Hey, welcome to Golfing Around. This week we're in beautiful Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. So let's tee it up. All right, I am back from the beach and I've made my way over here with just a little pitching wedge to the TPC Myrtle Beach. This is my new bestest buddy in the world, Steve, who knows a little bit about this golf course. That's right, you're here at TPC Myrtle Beach. It's the only five-star golf course ranked by Golf Digest places to play here in Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. You know what, my mother told me that the company you keep tells me about you and there are only five star ratings and with you is Pinehurst number two in Kiowa and the TPC here so you're keeping pretty good company. It is, it's pretty good company and there's only three golf courses in the Carolinas, TPC being one of them and obviously number two in, in Kiowa Island so it's a fantastic golf course. It was designed by Tom Fazio, opened up in 1998, hosted senior tour championships here. Lanny Watkins was a player consultant to help Tom with this golf course and it's a, it's a really beautiful 18 holes that goes through the wetlands and the marshlands here of uh, Low Country in South Carolina. You know, going back to the three tournaments that were held here with the PGA players, Tom Watson, Gary McCord, and Hal Irwin. Pretty good lineup. I, yeah, that's a pretty good lineup. <laughs> so if it was good enough for them, I'm going to say it's good enough for you and maybe not me so much. But what makes this course so special? I, I mean, just putting a TPC title on it, I mean, that doesn't happen easily. That's exactly right. It's a TP, TPC facility, and so it, we, we have it to the highest standards of quality of golf course and, and the conditions of the facility. I mean, it's, it's, uh, it's fantastic little bit wet here it's later in the season but you know what over in Scotland Steve they play in the rain all the time and we will play in the rain today and I think I'm gonna take you today in this wet weather you know what you probably will <laughs> <laughs> so let's head out to the golf course let's tee it up we're golfing around from TPC Myrtle Beach all right hole number five is where we're gonna pick this up it is a beautiful par three but before we get to this challenge and it is a challenge at 131 yards yes it is how far are we from the beach because I keep seeing the seagulls coming in and out you're probably about a mile from the beach right here the oceans the ocean the waves are hitting the the sand right now I can hear it Sally saw seashells at the seashore that's right something like that <laughs> This is the first of the par threes that you're gonna see out here. First of four, and all four par threes at the TPC are spectacular golf holes. And as we take our journey around here, you'll see that. It's really a, the strong point of the golf course. That's gonna turn over a little bit. Get inside them. Good shot. Thanks. Nice shot. I believe you are outside of me. It, unbelievably so, I, I think I am. Yes, that's <laughs> called Pittsburgh touch there. That's a gimme. With your putty stroke, I think that's good. <laughs> All right, with that's that question. A gimme. Thank that you, question. you're a nice lady. Good too. Here's your. There's a weapon. But you're not okay. going to need that what? because there is a really nice trap over there that, oh, yes, nice. Come on. Do you really want me to it's try it? It's a nice out? trap. Show the people at home the trap. It's okay, I'll show, you the, I'll show you the trick out of those. All right. All right, simulating the ocean breeze. I see that. Well done. She's all yours. All right, well this was what's great about this golf hole here. Not only do you have the water in front of the green, but if you hit it over or someone tosses it in here, <laughs> you got a tough bunker shot to try to get up and down for par. So let me see if I can get it up and, and try to trickle it down to the, towards the hole. Close the club face. Like this, yep. Yeah, and s decelerate. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Go in. Oh! oh! Settle, 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 settle. So those are those fast greens right there. If this was August, it would have been gone, huh? That's right, it would have been in the water. Well, wow, that was nice. You know what, you don't even got to putt that in. That's good? Come on, I'll help you out. <laughs> Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. In Scotland, they have beautiful Lynx golf courses and ladies and gentlemen wearing kilts. And they also have what in Scotland? A little bit of rain. A little bit of rain in Scotland. They got a little bit of rain in Myrtle Beach today. But I tell you what, I will take golf, rain, snow, sunshine. I love it. That's exactly right. It, it barely rains here in Myrtle Beach. But we do have a little bit today, but it's a great day here at TPC. Always is. Number 15, spectacular. Love the superintendent here. Love the greenskeeper. How are you going to play 15? Tell us all about it. 
Well, this is kind of the teeth of the golf course right here, the 15th hole. It's a great driving hole. You got to drive it to the right side of the fairway uh, and try to keep it in play. You got to carry a little bit of wetland um, and then you get, got to favor the right side of the fairway so you can get a great entry into the green here. See, he went and said the operative words, keep it in play. As you that's know so far, right. I have a little tendency <laughs> not keeping it in a play. You can see the beautiful fescue in front of us. You got to carry that. My ball tends to push <laughs> right through there. So I'm going to give you the honors on this hole. Okay, I will do my best. I talk a great game. We'll see how I swing it here on 15. Oh, you forgot we're playing 20 bucks a hole. <laughs> So that's perfect. I think that's going to be on the right hand side. It's going to leave me a good shot into this green um, at the TPC here at the 15th hole. Well, I really hit the ball great. I ended up here on the right hand side of the fairway. I've got about 140 yards to the middle of the green, but the pin's a little bit up today. So I think about, I got about 125 yards to the pin. Uh, the 15th hole is a classic example of what you'll find here at the TPC. You have three bunkers. It's a Tom Fazio golf course. You can see the high lip bunkers behind me. Um, it's a fantastic green complex and let's see what I can do here. Uh oh, oh, give me some love. Oh, is that <laughs> beautiful? Did you see that? I ended up on the green. You played this course before? Once or twice. Really nice. Nice, nice, nice. So I'll take what that. What more one. can you say? That I was nice. I hit it. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? He's not so, you're not so bad. <laughs> hey, every once in a while you get lucky, right? His boss told me he was, you know, a choker, but you know, you're, the pressure's <laughs> on with the TV. So tell me what the idea is here. These fabulous greens are rolling kind of slow because of the rain. Yeah, the rain slowed them down. They typically run, I mean, this is TPC. We try to keep the facility here to PGA Tour quality. So the yep. guests here um, really experience uh, what, what the tour professionals experience when they're out playing, playing in golf tournaments. They're a little bit slower today uh, because of the weather, but this is going to break a little bit, a little bit to the right. Um, on me here and uh, let me see if I can get this in here and uh, try to get my uh, my birdie. Well I don't want to give you any pressure but you remember when the senior tour championship was here? Mm -hmm. 2001? Yes. Uh, I think it was Watson he just sunk it. So. He made this putt as accurate yeah. from here yeah. so I, I yeah. remember the read from no there pressure. So I think I can knock it in. No pressure. <laughs> That's not bad. It's got sweetheart. a chance. It's got a turn. That's not bad. I'll take that. That's an easy tap in for a par there. That's a gimme. Pick it up. Is that good? You yeah, sure? Pick it up. Okay. Foul. I win. <laughs> let's go down and see what the rest of this beautiful track has to offer. All right, let's do it. Randy, here we are at, at um, 16 in the fairway. This is a great short par four. At least I've got about 100 yards into the green, and this this green complex really is, really typifies what you'll find here at TPC Myrtle Beach. You see the great bunker, and you see the high face bunker, which is typical of Tom Fazio and in, in the in the in the design elements he put here at the TPC Myrtle Beach. Uh, once you get, you've got a tabletop green up there that's probably going to roll about uh, 11 or 12 on the stint meter, um, and it's really a fantastic golf hole. It's got to sit down a little bit. Well, I'm going to have a little putt at this one, so I've got to, uh, I'm going to have to, a little test for me this time. Did you guys have fun today? Yeah. yeah. So did I. I had a lot of fun, especially since it wasn't raining like it does in Scotland. You've been to Scotland a bunch of times, haven't you? Yeah. No, Randy. But anyway, Fila makes some of the best stuff in golf today. This is the Golfing Around Equipment Review of the Week. Breathable fabric lets the water repel off. So you know what? Sometimes, even when it's not raining out, you can find some water if you said something like, dump away. Oh, oh, oh! Look at, look at that. Is that funny? Oh, girl, oh. Fila, I'm telling you, this stuff is awesome. <laughs> oh, you. Could you imagine trying, how many golf courses you guys own? We own and manage 23 facilities. Could you imagine waking up every morning with the responsibility of running 23 golf courses, everything that goes, I don't know what goes into that. What goes into that, Scott? Well, operating the golf course goes from the golf shop to the staff, 
uh, to the facility and the maintenance of the golf course itself, food and beverage operations, and most importantly, general customer service. So it's not a very important job you have. No, some days are better <laughs> than others, let's just say. Wow, what responsibilities, that's incredible. Let's talk a little bit about part of your job, which is maybe the most important job as far as I'm concerned, and the golfers, the course, the turf, the conditions of the greens, the fairways. This is a TPC course, it's unbelievable. You could play a, a pro event here, I think, in a couple of weeks. Absolutely, you know, our, as I mentioned, customer service and the condition of the facilities are the two most important parts of, of what we do as a company, what our operators do, what our agronomic teams, our vice president of agronomy, all of what they do day in and day out is maintaining the product that our golfers who come to visit Myrtle Beach get to experience. Yeah, I mean, the conditions here are incredible. Let's talk about your heat conditions. And I'm just, I'm curious at home. When you've got to spend that extra time in, say, July and August when the heat is kind of oppressive and, and getting on, on top of you down here, what goes into your day there? I mean, you got to go and look at each golf course and say, okay, what kind of damage? What? It's got to be extra effort. Well, it's, it's ensuring that you have the right turf and that you're putting the proper applications on before you get into those situations, before you get to that time of the year. So it's really preparing for the different seasons, the different climates that we get here in South Carolina. So kind of like if I'm preparing in the fall for the winter for my, my lawn at home, I'm throwing down some fertilizer and things like that. Absolutely, or, or in our case where we're overseeding our golf courses, so we're ensuring that they're green and continuing to be refreshed throughout the season, throughout the winter months when the normal turf, the um, traditional turf here in South Carolina has gone dormant for the winners. See, he, he sounds like he knows what he's talking about. Uh, you know, I just picked it up as we go here. No, you guys know exactly what you're doing. Congratulations, you're doing a great job at all the golf courses you guys manage. Uh, I don't particularly care for you, but you at least seem to keep your employment going. Well, I appreciate you uh, putting up with me for a few seconds here. All right, whatever. <laughs> Hey, if you're like me, you like par threes, because I'm a high handicap, as you're learning. Yes, real I quick. learned really quick. Anybody can play their best. They can play Arnold Palmer for 20 bucks on a par three, right? Yeah, that's exactly right. Well, let's, are we going to do that bet now? No, my back's hurting. <laughs> From this ball to the flag, it is 180 yards on this beautiful signature hole here at TPC. Tell the folks about it. Well, it is. It's our signature hole here, 17. It's a peninsula green surrounded by water. And just think about playing the Senior Tour Championship like that was played here. The pressure of the the pressure of the, the crowd, the gallery watch, and the pressure of the event, trying to win an event here and have to clear 160 yards of water onto a peninsula green. It makes for an exciting finish. It really allows the players that come play this event to feel like they're playing in a PGA Tour event. My knees are shaking already thinking if I had to play in front of human beings. <laughs> you know that famous Ben Hogan picture where they're, they're taking a picture behind him and everybody's Everest. circle. How did he do that? That's you pressure, just, man. You just got to pull the trigger at well, some guess, point. Here, you pull the trigger. No pressure here. Okay. Beautiful signature hole, number 17, TPC Myrtle Beach. See what you got. I'll see what I can do here. I just got to find the center of the green there. Sit down, I'll take it. On a hole like this, I don't even look at the pin. I'm just trying to find the center of the green to make sure I clear the water and give myself a chance for birdie and even better, two putt for par. All right, well this is a two tier green and so the, the, it is breaking off the right hand tier here. So I'm gonna play it to the right and hopefully break back to the left and get my, uh, get my birdie. Well, it's absolutely amazing because it looks like you're on a plateau over there. I mean, this is an incredible green complex. Yes, it is. It's got a chance. Oh. Hit it. Oh. 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 oh! You're gonna give me that one too? I thought Such that a was bad a two. Ball. Go in your hole, right? <laughs> Go that home. That was nice. That was nice. That's a pretty good putt there. I'll take that. You're, you're not so bad, kid. I think a few lessons over at the golf academy. Well the, the great thing about our golf school is again it's it's not theory model based. It's we're gonna take what you have and, and improve on it. So a lot of times if someone's only learned under one instructor, they're always going to teach under that one way that they learned. We take a lot of pride in that we really never give the same lesson probably ever. You know, we're going to teach based on the individual strengths and weaknesses and help them with their weaknesses. But uh, that's probably the big thing I've learned out on tour is there's a lot of different ways of doing it. Even the most elite, you don't find a lot of swings that look the same, but there's a lot of things that they do at the golf ball that are the same. 
your company is running some of the best properties down here, yeah. not only the TPC, but tell us about well, the whole portfolio. Is yeah, that the, the word, Bob? Yeah, that, that's the word. I, I think, uh, you know, Thanks, Randy, for acknowledging that. You know, we just recently brought TPC into the into the group, and uh, we're tickled to death. It it goes in parallel with some of our other great courses. You know, just recently this summer in June, we held the National PGA Club Professional Championship at the Grand Dunes Resort in conjunction with the Dunes Club, and uh, it was televised on the Golf Channel. It was an exciting event. Um, it was fabulous. Um, you know, we hold the Holiday Junior Amateur championships been going on for a number of years and winners have gone on to play on many of the tours. We hold that at Myrtle Beach National, one of three golf courses at that facility, but Kings North is truly the champ of those three facilities. Arnold Palmer. Yeah, Arnold Palmer. Uh, actually redesigned in the early 90s at the tune of about $7 million, so it's got every amenity you could possibly want on a golf course. It's fabulous. And I think probably one of the things that's most attracting to all the people that come to visit us and play golf is that our golf courses stretch throughout the 60 mile strand. So we've got golf courses that we manage and own that are less than 10 minutes from Calabash. And we have facilities such as the one that you're staying at, Pauly's Plantation. Oh, first um, class. Yeah, which is only 70 miles from Charleston and everything in between. So it's not only a wonderful mix of golf courses, but geographically it stretches the entire strand. So given the opportunity to play a National Golf Management golf course, it's available to you almost everywhere on the strand. I'm going to shoot straight with you here. You yep. know what I like so far? is the people are friendly and they're keeping it real. Nothing upsets me and maybe you at home. You work hard for your paycheck, right? Yeah. You come in and somebody's grumpy and mean. They're just taking their money from you. You know, go out there on the course. Yeah. Your staff has been great. I mean, even the folks this morning over at Polly's with the breakfast, it was about 6 in the morning. They all had a smile on their face, and I sincerely mean that. The qual It's service. You're in the service industry. Yeah, we are in the service industry. I mean, I, we don't forget that here uh, at National Golf Management. You know, we're in the opportunity, given the opportunity to make the game fun for people, and that means arrival and departure, right? We want your arrival to be warm and greeting and your departure to be friendly and welcoming to come back. You've got the quality service, we know that. We, you've got the great courses like TPC here, but why seriously, why book with your company? Well, you know, I, I think you mentioned earlier on that the economy's been a little difficult for everybody today and, and the dollar doesn't quite go as far, so, you know, we take it very seriously keeping a pulse on our customers and, and growing our database and staying in touch with them and last fall we put a program co together called the primetime rewards program so book four rounds of golf within our portfolio at our website that uh, we would like to say is very progressive very interactive uh, it's M is in Michael B is in boy N is in Nancy.com MBN.com Myrtle Beach National but book on our site call our call center call any one of our golf shops, purchase four rounds within our portfolio and receive a $100 gift card for your choice to use in any of the golf shops at any given day uh, for any product or service. So for food and beverage, for merchandise, uh, spend 50 here today at TPC would what be What if I wanted thing. to play another fifth round of golf? Oh, you can help yourself and use it for your replay. You're so, all right. See, yeah. I knew I liked you when I sat down here. <laughs> it's great. And at the end of the day, it's all about golf, right? It yeah. just, just can't get any better than that. So the customers great love game. it. Great game. Did you know that? It's a great game? It is a great game. I think they know it's yeah, a great it game. it is a great game. And, uh, you know, we try and share that uh, just by the fact of making sure that rounds are are flowing properly, conditions are good, people are friendly, make it easy for people to make their decision to play the game of golf, right? And you get people, because of the homey feel around here with the friendliness, I know you get a lot of repeat play. We do, you only got one chance, right? So when they're coming and when they're leaving, to tell them thanks for coming, come back and see us again, right? And the biggest compliment we can get is the amount of repeat business that we see. It, it's just marvelous to see that whole I-95 corridor and across the border keep coming down each and every year. All right, we did not actually hit the balls here. We dropped them here because we're having a little competition. Closest to the pin from here, That's you're it. up. That, you gonna, are you going to clear the water? You worry about your ball. <laughs> tell them if I'm going to clear the ball. All right, let's see what we can do. All right, 100 bucks closest to the pin. That's all? That's it. I thought this was a $200 it's hole. It's nothing but a thing. Nothing but a thing. Oh, that's got no oh, chance. That's, that's a little left. Wet. That is a little left. That is a little bit wet. All right. 
Well, so he agreed to a. Oh, where are you going? You agreed a hundred dollars closest to the pin. Yeah, and I'm so going to get the cart your and drive mine up there and get my hundred bucks from him. <laughs> there you go. Steve, thank you. I enjoyed it. That was a lot of fun. Did you laugh? I laughed. I cried. All the emotions. Yeah, golf is supposed to be fun. <laughs> Don't forget that. That's right. Give them the website again. You got to get down to Myrtle Beach. I know a lot of you have never even been down here yet, which is a sin. That's exactly right. You've got. If you're a golfer, you've got to get down to Myrtle Beach, South Carolina, and you can go to MB n.com and book all your golf uh, for your Myrtle Beach golf vacation. It's as easy as that. Is this your ball? That's your ball. <laughs> well, you might as well have done that anyway. The, all right, the you golf only owe me $99, all right? You only owe me $99. <laughs>